you're getting better all the time and turning all against one is an art that's hard to teach. Okay, hey everybody, I'm back after a small delay. What uh, what had happened was uh, actually kind of funny. Um, I lost my save data for my uh, emulator here, and I had to get all the way back to where I was, which wasn't a big deal, except I spent like two hours trying to catch Sableye. So, but uh, yeah, small difference in levels, not a big deal. Uh, I got the egg. That hoot hoot is there just for flash, so don't expect him to be used. And yeah, we're going to get going. We had just beaten Sprout Tower, the gym leader, and Carlos. So we're going to head down here to, I think, is this the route? Yeah, Route 32. We're going to head to Azalea Town. Let's come down here. You can catch Mareeps, Ekans. Ooh, here's a Mareep. Uh, yeah. So this is a Mareep. I don't plan on using one. And a couple people guessed on the next Pokemon I'm going to use. And I can assure you it's not a Wooper. <laughs> Although I do think uh, Woopers are kind of funny. It's uh, not a Wooper, though. Um, I was originally going to use an Ekans, but uh, due to a request by another viewer, I decided not to. So, yeah. Ooh, that was pretty pro burn right there, wasn't it? And he's level 17. Pro! So, yeah, come down here. You can challenge this girl. Uh, you actually have to challenge her. She's not going to be able to see you. Be careful. This thing has poison point, so don't try to attack it with physical stuff if, unless you have an antidote or something. So, yeah. But I was going to use an Ekans, but someone... Offered another Pokemon. I already have my team already all planned out now. But yeah, I have all my team all planned out. And I'm ready to go. There's a, there's a potion right there. I can't wait till I can get some repels. And uh, now we're going to go fight some fishermen. So, yeah. You can go this way, which is a quicker way to get to the town. Or you can go this way to fight the fishermen. I'm going to fight the fishermen. This guy, he's just got a bunch of Magikarps. Definitely want to super speed through this. I wonder if Ember will do more. Not very effective, but still does half. Tackle does less than half, so it'd be better off just using Ember. They're Magikarps. They don't offer much experience at all. Maybe like a level. Maybe. That's pretty beast critical. It'll help me save some time. Not even a level. Half a level. Well, this one's level 19, but, I mean, it's still a Magikarp. <sighs> this guy just needs to go... This level 19 one, he needs to go into some tall grass right now fight a couple of things and turn that into a Gyarados and then turn the rest of his Magikarp into Gyarados and you know what he'll be way more useful and he'll beast on some people he'll be the best fisherman ever but for right now he is a punk and uh, yeah sploosh so you went and saw Iron Man 2 that, I, I think it's pretty awesome a lot of people said it sucked but you know, I liked it I didn't think it was terrible um it was I just like the superhero movies I, I don't really hate any of them the only one I really hated was the first Hulk one, and, um, yeah, that's the only real, ah, Poison Point, this guy has Poison Point too, so, yeah, we gotta switch to Sableye, but, uh, that's fine, most moves don't affect him, boom, astonish, minimize, uh, I'm not even scared of that, let's finish it with Nightshade, or, or maybe not, but, uh, yeah, so, don't worry, ooh, level up, and he says Sploosh too. Put Sableye out front, and uh, Kalava can take some damage, because here's another fisherman. Woo! So much action! Goldeen, give it some Astonish. The reason I'm using Astonish is just because it can flinch hacks them like that. Boom! Take it. Take it all in. So we're going to run down here, and here's another trainer that we can fight. Um, he's got a whooper. We're just going to astonish it. Critical hit. That's awesome. Mud Sport, not a big deal. Finished him off. Level 18 Sableye now. His name was Gordon, too. So this guy would ask you to buy a Slowpoke Tail. And you know what? That's an... In I am going to... What? Slowpoke Tails? i got to get to the bottom of this. Team Rocket should not be endorsing Slowpoke Tail. And we do not. At least I do not. So I'm going to heal up here. And the reason, the only reason I'm showing you this heal up is because you come over here, talk to this fisherman, man, person... And he will give you an old rod. So now, oh, here we got our trainer. He's mad because you beat Faulkner. He's like, Fal how did you beat him? He was so, I, I did it again. Super speed betrays me. Yeah, these guys aren't affected because they're normal types too. I hate that, but whatever. Um, yeah, so expect back, me being back to one to two videos a day now that I'm back to where I was. 
and I'm keeping multiple saves now just in case so I don't have to constantly come back so yeah so thank you for all my new subscribers and people commenting keep them coming keep giving me suggestions on things you might like to see and I can still maybe change my team up it's not a big deal to me I will change my team up if it is wanted so now I am gonna have a little trouble I am gonna have a little trouble in this place but uh, one of my new team members is in here actually and uh, yeah so we will get it I don't know what I'm going to do nightshade is probably the best way to do it. Yeah, Nightshade is definitely what's going to be getting me through some of these rock types. And, uh, yep. Finished off that Onyx pretty easily. Nothing too major. Sableye growing like crazy. But, um, yeah, we got to switch to Quilava so he can get some experience. But my, the next po my next team member is in here, and I want to make sure I catch him early, not later. So, hold on real quick while I go find him. Okay, here it is. A Sand Shrew. That's right. I'm going to be using a Slan Slash on my run, because I want to get a Pokemon from first generation on my team. Which I will be using another first generation one, but uh, you won't get to see it till later. So yeah, and he's pretty low right now. And the reason I chose Sand Slash is because I really like him. He's one of my favorites. And it's just an overall pretty good Pokemon. And uh, let's use a Great Ball on this guy. Let's catch him in style. Yep, caught him. Sandshrew's really good or sand slash when he evolves. Well, okay, you're probably wondering what I'm doing out here. It's because I'm going to train my sand slash, or sand shrew, a little up before I continue through the cave, just so you don't have to bear with the switch training and stuff. So I'm going to go do that, and I'll be right back. Okay, I just got sand uh, shrew to level 11. I didn't give him too much goings on because, well, there was no need to. Um... 11 should be fine for what I need, and I went into the dark cave and I got him roll out. The only reason I didn't show it was because I two-shotted the nose pass in there with Sableye's Nightshade, pretty much. So, yeah, still wish I had repels. Still do. I don't know if I can buy them yet. I really didn't look. I think I get them in the next town. Can't wait. Um, so we're going to go through Union Cave a little bit in the next episode, and I'll see you then.